my fork, ivory, my favorite jacket, Wolverine, two hundred dollar belt, leather, feet warmers, okay? Chimpanzee hair, my favorite snack, pigs. I don't get what's up with all this animal rights stuff. I'm getting, I'm getting a lot of emails. Uh, keep coming at me with like, oh, you hurt animals. I ain't never hurt one animal that didn't deserve it, okay? That's all I'm trying to say. I don't go to look, pick fights with animals. You guys make it sound like I'm going down my alley trying to find cats to shoot. If I'm in my backyard, okay, and a cat is trespassing on my property, uh, I'm going to shoot it. I don't like cats, okay? Basically, I'm going to shoot him. So he tells all the other little kitties, okay, don't go in Todd's yard. That way I only have to shoot one cat. Because if you don't go tell them that, I'm going to have to shoot 40, 50 cats, okay? I don't want to do that. I got a fork I bought in TJ, one of my favorite forks. I use that all the time. Uh, my jacket, I, women love that jacket. But then again, when women on the internet, I got them sending me hate comments. So make up your mind, ladies. You love my jacket or you hate it? I basically, I got these random ass people sending me hate comments over uh, email, uh, trying to tell me about animal rights. First of all, I don't know anything about animal rights. I can't speak animal. And I don't think it's right for someone to come at me with animal rights. If they don't even understand human rights. Does that make sense to you? Oh, I love this animal, so I'm going to cuss out this man I don't even know over the internet. Okay, let's talk about human rights for a second. We put these animals on the back burner until we get that right. Hey, let's put these animals on the back burner until we get a world peace. Forget all these animals. Hey, I like them. They're cute. Okay, but I ain't going to make them a priority of mine if I can't get along with my brethren. So if you're yapping your mouth about animal rights and how animals feel, you go ahead and yap your mouth. But I ain't never ran into another person that can communicate with an animal. So I don't see how you could tell me how an animal feels. You're probably just coming home from work, okay? You're probably stressed out. I understand. Take out on your man. Stop taking out on Todd. You know, you girls vent in very different ways. You girls are crazy. Animal rats. Man, you should love them animals. They'll post me in my 18 wheel of snake. Snake skin. What do you want me to do? Turn, turn it on my shit? I can't even be Todd. And basically, if you guys are going to start, like, a big organization about animals' rights, uh, wh why the hell do you name it after a damn tortilla? You know, you ask a Mexican what a tortilla is, a pita is, they're going to tell you, well, put carne in that damn thing, okay? It, the, you guys didn't even get it straight from the get-go. So you guys need to go back, uh, redo your name. I don't even know what the hell it stands for, but literally it means pita, like bread, you know? Man, you guys, when you guys come at me, you infuriate me because you guys got so many holes in your game. Yeah, a bunch of stressed out women running an organization talking about animals. And you guys talk about cats. You guys talk about dogs. But you guys go ahead and uh, make that Michael Vick guy out to be like a like a homicidal maniac. Those are just dogs. Couldn't fucking speak English. So what? It was his property. Shit. Leave him alone. Okay, he's going doing the time. Stop talking shit about him. Why don't you guys go after something that's like going extinct? Like sharks. Why don't you guys go after sharks or stuff, you know? Go after, like, uh, a moon bat stingray. You guys probably never even heard of that. You guys have to look that up, okay? Uh, you, you know, white tigers. You guys go after white tigers. You know I mean? Those are going extinct. Hey, I'm a white tiger. I don't need crazy bitches to worry about me, okay? I do my own thing. You bitches stay in America. Don't come to where I live. You guys making a big thing out of nothing. I've talked to many animals, and many animals don't give a fuck about PETA. I live in a tree right next to a factory. That build your hybrid cars, okay? And they're polluting the environment. I eat fucking motor oil for breakfast sometimes by accident. So fucking stop. Stop with your uh, all your Todd bashing. Okay? If I could, I would. If I had a two hands instead of four four paws, I'd start a Todd organization. Called Tita. Okay? And stop trying to parent animals, okay? Your daughters are doing random shit on the weekend you don't even know about. And you're worried about cats and dogs. That is uncivilized. We don't need any help from humans. Humans are taking our fucking land. Okay? Hey, we don't want any help from you. Even if you guys could help us, we'd say fuck you. Even being a white tiger, I don't even understand how people get into other people's business because they don't even know. You know? It's just crazy. And I really don't understand how they do that. So, so being a white tiger, we kind of have like this, this code we don't know anybody, or we don't get in their business. Some good links. Alright, good links. Come on, guys. Take a treat.